All right, guys. Now I'm gonna be doing a uh, how to how to make two how to make two Cortex elevators uh, into a destination dispatch. Now this is going to be updated because they actually the Cortex has actually changed modernized the model. So if I do Cortex, look at this. Okay, let me let me put it over here. They have completely changed the floor indicator. It is no longer a seven segment display. It's now a dot matrix display like like Cobalt Plus. So we're gonna be doing we're gonna be making this into a, a destination dispatch system. So everything's gonna be the same except this one's gonna have a a dot matrix display. So that we need to first remove the floor buttons because we do not need them. Now this is going to be the same as if you want to make a multi bay, but you do not need to move move the buttons. However, for this setup, we need to remove the buttons. This is updated um, to do that. Um, and we're also going to delete the floor buttons in here because you do not need the floor buttons. Delete. And now you want to leave with this into. A group you need to, um and you want to no not delete it you want to duplicate it no you want to you want to duplicate this and put right here right next to the other one and you want to label this as B And you want to group these. Name these elevators. Now you w now uh, you want to get the travel efficient package. This is going to show uh, how to put, how to make the the floor panels work as well. Whoa! This is how to make the floor panels work as well. So don't worry. Now, where you've made it as elevators, you want to move that into the package. And and then you want to make... So let's do the destination panels first. So, unlike Cobalt, unlike you need to ungroup these um, in the car in order for it to work. However, for this setup, you do not need to ungroup them. So you want to make sure... You want to make sure this panel is in line with this. Now this will work on any elevator that is running a Cortex script. So... So you always want to make sure that these panels are, are bolted to the display. You want to make sure this is directly inside the, directly in in the car. Now, if you want, you could. Now we're gonna move this down so to make it easier, and then you want to duplicate it so we can place it in the other elevator. This will be the exact same as all another one, except we do not need to do any of the other stuff. Now, you want to move this into elevators, so this one here is going to be A. You put it in the car, and then that's it. You do. You want to do the same for the other one as well. Place this in the car. Now, you're done with the, the destination the destiny of the panel, so you do not need to worry about the elevators now. Now, we're going to go with the hall lanterns. And this is by far the one of the most easiest, easiest one to do. You do not even need to change the label on this. On the video with the older one, it changed label, but it's just like Cobot on Oldest Compass. You do it has a custom labeling feature that 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 allows you to put labels on this without having to change the label inside. So now we need to make this. We need to duplicate it. Put it onto this floor. 
I'm going to leave this to two. So I'm going to let you see that. Then you want to duplicate it again. Now you now you now I recommend using Control D if you're on a computer or Command D if you're on a MacBook. Right now I'm on a computer, so so whenever you're on a computer or Mac, it should be either Command or Control. On a MacBook, it's definitely, it's definitely Command, but um, but you should still be able to figure it out. So duplicate this one. Label this as B. Move this all the way over here. All the way over here. Make sure it's centered in. Um, make sure it's centered in. Now you're done with the Hollanders. Now we're going to do the panels. We are going to do the panels now. Now, I should try this before when on the old one. For some reason, I got a glitch where it says, Please scan card. And I don't understand why it said that. I seriously didn't understand. So... Just make just make sure if you ask Electric Kid for help. I'm gonna give him credit for um helping me make this happen. But this is on a newer Cortex elevator, so this is by far gonna be my original because this is all this is a newer one, so Alright, so now you want to play test it. So I do have a spawn point here. We're gonna move that over there so that we we're closer to the Elevators, and then we're gonna be able to test them to see if they actually work. Okay, you can see that the panels, all the panels just booted up. You just saw that. Go to floor. Now this should work. Type three. Now you want to change the orientation of that because that is backwards from default. But yes, it's working. The, see this Destiny Cancer Storm Street? And it's closed automatically. See, God makes this display. I really liked new Cortex. See, everything's working. Now the chimes are the same. Uh, the chimes are the same on the course. On these cortex, on this one, the chimes are the same. So you want to temporary like if you want to do this simply, just type it on the first panel and then copy it to the next. Next, so you want to make this left, and then the other one you want to make it right. Because I don't know why the orientation would be backwards. You can also probably do uh, you can probably do diagonal uh. Diagonal parts, like, I don't know how to do that, though. I'm not as smart to do that. But yeah, you can see it works. Now we're actually going to set the... The directions to be crap. Not a three. We want that to be two first. This next one's going to be three. And move that over to the top. So, um, you're basically already done with the, with this package. So you can actually go into settings and, and you can actually change this if you want to. So you can actually change it to like, uh, like welcome to the game, maybe, as well. Um, you can also make it so that a card, if you scan for the admin panel, it will make it uh, act as a floor. And that way you can get it to do it. However, I don't know how to make how to lock off floors on on Cortex scripts. But you're basically almost already done with the travel person package. Now on on if you're doing this on a Cobalt Plus, you can you if you're doing this on a Cobalt Plus, it won't basically be the same. Um, but here's the thing: on Cobalt Plus, if you wanted to get the destination panels working, you have to ungroup them. Um, the Cortex one will not work with the Cobalt Plus, that's for sure, but make sure when you do doing, like, doing a uh, Otis Compass Destiny's panel, make sure you ungroup it in order for it to work. If you don't ungroup it, it's never going to work. So, hopefully you guys enjoyed.